you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy gospel by wisdom ministries december 15th tuesday let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint matthew chapter 21 verses 28 to 32 what do you think a man had two sons he went to the first and said son go and work in the vineyard today he answered i will not but later he changed his mind and went the father went to the second and said to the same and he answered i go sir but he did not go which of the two did the will of his father they said the first jesus said to them truly i tell you the tax collectors and the prostitutes are going into the kingdom of god ahead of you for john came to you in the way of righteousness and you did not believe him but the tax collectors and the prostitutes believed him and even after you saw it you did not change your minds and believe him the gospel of the lord to praise the lord jesus christ dear friends it helps to be aware that today's gospel reading follows immediately and it says uh, when the authority of jesus was called into question jesus today offers the religious leaders a parable it is about two sons who were asked by their father to go and work in his vineyard one refused to go but later he repented and went the other son said he would go but he did not the question is then which of the two did the will of his father the parable can be read on two levels on a more general level it is a common theme of the gospel that doing is more important than mere words it is not those who just say lord lord who will enter the kingdom the important thing is actually to carry out the will of god in our daily lives on more particular level the parable points to the situations which jesus was facing the religious leaders and many of the apparently religious people who believed they were following god's ways refused to believe in john the baptist and after him jesus himself on the other hand people who were rather yes deeply sinful and violators of the law tax collectors and prostitutes responded to the call of john to repentance they were deeply moved by john's preaching changed their ways and were baptized by him in the jordan even after that the religious leaders still made no move when jesus came again the religious leaders refused to see god's hand in all he was doing while huge crowds gathered around him it is clear which group is finding its way into the kingdom of course we are not reflecting on these readings just to know how proud and arrogant the chief priests and the elders were they are for us to reflect on for our own lives do we think that because we are practicing Christians we are in a privileged and untouchable position do we send this lot of time praying in church but not doing much living outside of it we have said yes to god by our baptism and membership of the church but can we say that we always carry out what god is asking us to do amen may god bless us